Ajole no koda bile Dile la bossi mi oko Awino lumbumba Gatu, 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 gama This one goes to all my fellow Africans <laughs> Living far away Far away Far and away from their hometown Hello and welcome to another exciting episode or edition of City Scene here on Global Culture. It's been a great day. I'm really happy to be here bringing to you another wonderful guest. My name is Shay Hopewell. I hope you all are doing fine today. We have in our studio a wonderful, pretty, brilliant songbird. And she is a gospel artist and also a songwriter. Her name is Anu. You're welcome today, Anu. How are you doing? Thank you very much. <laughs> I'm glad to be here today. It's so good to have you in our studio. You look great. Thank you so much. You, you are too. Blinging. Thank you. Uh, for our viewers at home, tell us your full name and what you do. All right. My name is Anu. Actually, my last name is Ashalethi. And um, I'm a gospel artist. And um, I'm glad to be here today. <laughs> <laughs> and so it's, it's a privilege and a honor to be invited to and to do an interview with a one and only beautiful oh, Shay of Well. Oh my goodness! <laughs> I am so glad to be okay, here. Okay, so um, here are two shy people talking now. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, tell us uh, about you as an artist. You're a gospel artist. Yeah. Tell me how you got into this. And I mean, phenomenal, by the way. I heard you are God. Thank you so much. It's phenomenal. I, I, I want the whole world to hear it. Oh, and part you. of the reason why I brought you into the studio today is, first of all, I'm a woman. I'm a woman advocate. And I believe and I support women who are doing great things. Oh. No matter what it is, no matter how little, how small, how large, but as long as you're contributing to the society yes. mm -hmm. and impacting the lives of other women, you have to be in this seat right here. That's right. <laughs> so tell us about you or God and anything else that you've been doing lately. Okay. Um, actually, I've been thinking for a long time. <laughs> like they, were, um, they put in my bio since yeah. I'm in a diapers, but <laughs> <laughs> but I've been singing for a while. Okay. I've been in the choir. Mm -hmm. um, I go to um, RCCG uh, Victory Temple mm -hmm. Laurel. And I'm part of the choir. There. I've been singing for a long time. I've yeah, I know. Actually, it wasn't supposed to um, host your um, album launch a few years ago. Yes. But you know what? The Bible does say mm -hmm. that, you know, the vision is for an appointed that's time. Right. And that that's time right. is now. Yes. And we're here in yes. the now. And yes. you're doing it. Yes. Years ago, so I met you and you were talking about, oh, you had this thing that you had to do mm -hmm. and da 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 da. Mm -hmm. And it's amazing that in 2011, boom. Yes. I mean, the way God works is so amazing. Mm -hmm. And um, it's so funny because mm -hmm. I've been singing for a long time, but sometimes when you have a gift in you, you yourself as a person, you don't even believe in yourself. Right. It's actually somebody else that saw the vision in me. And it was so, because somebody introduced me, my sister-in-law actually introduced me to a pastor called okay. Pastor Wayne Wilson, okay. and he's a producer. Um, this is like top producer that produced for City Winers really? and BB Winers. Yeah. But and when I spoke to him, and I was kind of reluctant. I'm like, I don't want to do this, you know. And he was like, no. For one reason, he was like, my spirit is just attached to oh, yours. I goodness. mean, I need to work. I don't care. I want to work with you. I believe there's a gift in you. And I was like, okay. And we did a section together. Mm -hmm. And when I wrote the song, You're God, and he produced it, it was so dumbfounded. He was like, you know what? You have to bring this song out. Oh, wow. And it's so funny how oh. God connects you to people. Yes. You just don't, you never know who will actually push you to fulfill that destiny. Right. And talking about pushing you to this, fulfill your destiny. Because yes. I see you have this big smile <laughs> and I see that huge rock on your <laughs> finger. So somebody else besides this producer mm -hmm. is pushing you to do yes. what you have to do. Yes. Tell us about your husband. My husband. And what role he plays yes. in this. Yes, my husband, that Charles. Oh, my gosh. Usher Lacey. Yeah. Um, oh, my goodness. Yeah, he has been my fan before, oh, wow. <laughs> for a long time, ever since we've been dating. And it's so funny because he put on our wedding website, oh, okay. and he put it there and said, you know, he's glad that he's my number one fan, and oh. he's not going to be surprised if my music takes me to another level. Oh. And this is the person that when I write music, mm -hmm. I have to run around the house with him and say, you have to listen to this. Oh. And sometimes he's like, you're so tired, I don't want to listen. <laughs> but I'm holding him like, you have to listen, like, what do you think? And mm -hmm. he's the first person to actually, you know, mm -hmm. um, listen to my music mm -hmm. before I even take it out. An awesome and, support. And yeah, yeah it, it, it's amazing that God used him as the head in 
the house to encourage me. Mm -hmm. And at, at the same time, the Lord connect me with somebody that is into music oh, that actually awesome. pushed me, in, which is the producer. Yes. But yes, my husband played a big role with that. I, I can't do How it. How does without family him. play a big role? Your mother, oh, um, my mom, my mom, my sister, mom. siblings. What are they saying about you right now? That they're seeing you on YouTube, seeing you on TV, <laughs> doing know. interviews. They're watching you right now on City Scene, know. and they're like, "Hold up." I Ooh, know what's I going know. on. So tell us what they're what they're. My siblings. Are. Oh my goodness! Actually, my mom. <laughs> mm. My mom always believed in me. Even when I don't sing on the right tone, he was like, yeah, you good, you can do it. <laughs> and I'll tell you, my brothers, you know, my brothers, they believe in me. But, you know, brothers, they're like, okay. You know, until when actually when they heard the song yeah. and they were like, oh, my God, you, I can't Could believe this. Be? So, But one thing about my family, every time I have a show mm -hmm. anywhere, they're there. they are there. Awesome. My brothers will come. Mm -hmm. My sister will be there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they don't care. They are there. Where was the time. last place you performed? Um, actually, I was at um, our CCG Victory Temple, okay. where we have a, a reviver for a week. Okay. And um, it's called the D Divine Encounter. Oh, we had that. I heard about and that. Yes, I minister about like four times a week. Now, <laughs> what does that things. pressure do for your voice? Oh Singing back to back to back like that know, for these but you know, programs. Honestly, when you when you prepare yourself and yes. you sing for a week, mm -hmm. you don't actually get the effect until after the program. Oh wow! Be then, because right now I've like I've been coughing since like oh. ugh, two days now from you know all the singing, mm -hmm. but you don't feel it when you are because when you're singing and you mm -hmm. sing from the depth of your heart, heart. It, it actually project with your voice mm -hmm. and everything just sound great. Mm -hmm. But after that, then you're like, uh oh, I'm tired. <laughs> yeah. you know, I'm singing, let me let me like, recuperate real quick. Yeah. yeah. So um, now talking about you know your music mm -hmm. being gospel yeah. versus all the social all the raps that we're hearing now mm -hmm. all the music of nowadays first of all talk to me about who your role models are people you looked up to growing up music wise oh I love CC Winans I How love did I know you were gonna say that. I do I know a lot of people say we look alike yeah like, that's, oh, that's a, yeah that's what I was like thinking. Cici, but I love Sissy Winer so much. She's like more like a, a mother in music. That I you listen. never met. I never, I know, I never met her. And funny enough, actually, I was supposed to because my producer called me, but oh, I was yeah? at work. He was like, I'm going to Sissy's concert. And you know, he knows them one on one. Tell, like me you, tell me you didn't turn her down. I was at work. <gasps> When he called, I was so upset because I couldn't just leave work. I was like, and he was like, oh, you know. I'll be like, bye. I know. <laughs> but he was like, don't worry. I mean, there's another time. I'm, oh. My belief one day is to meet with her one-on-one. Yes. -on -one. Actually, yeah. do a song with her. You hear that, CC? <laughs> I know who wants to meet do you. Do a song with her. Do a song right now. So in case she happens to watch, I'm a big believer in okay, the um, most impossible things. And I want to meet Oprah one day, by the way. All right. <laughs> Get on the own network, but you're gonna do a song real quick, just in okay. case CC Winans happens to be watching right oh, now. What song goodness. would you like her to hear you sing? Oh. And make sure oh. you're not off pitch. Oh Lord, have mercy! <laughs> oh my God, you put me in the so, yeah. Well, um, like my my wonderful song that I like to um, mm. sing. You deserve the glory. Um, you deserve the glory and the honor. As I lift my hands and worship and I glorify your name, oh, you deserve the glory uh -uh. and the honor. As I lift my hands and worship and I glorify your name, for you are great, you the miracle so great. Mm -mm. There is no one else like you. There is no one else like you. For you are great. You the miracle so great. There is no one else like you. There is no one else like you. Like you. Watch me be like the backup singer. <laughs> so you hear that, Cece? That's my girl, Anu. And she yeah. has a single out. It's called yeah. you, you Are, are God. God. And also she has a single coming out November 24th, right on Thanksgiving Day. Yeah. She has a wonderful single coming out. And she's going to tell us more about that. Tell me more yeah. about that. Yeah, The Rock is uh, my the second. The Rock. Yes. 
a second song. Actually, I wrote the song because, you know, sometimes you have to just know for sure mm -hmm. that your faith is built on nothing, nothing. less mm -hmm. except for the um, Word of God mm -hmm. and except for God. And the Lord is always has to be our solid rock mm -hmm. and our solid foundation mm -hmm. at all times. And that's the reason why I wrote the song, The Rock. But it's a very, it's a jam, it's a song you can jam anywhere at a really? party. Yes, it's a fast, up-tempo. Okay, you know what I'm about music. to do next, right? <laughs> oh, Lord. So I heard the 21 second promo on oh. YouTube, and I'm like, where'd it go? <laughs> What's going on? So you're about to give me a 30 second promo right now. Oh, no. Okay. Of you, uh, you gave me, um, you've talked about your God. Mm -hmm. You're now going to give us a promo mm -hmm. of what to expect. Of the rock, yes. The Do your rock, little promo right now. Okay, the <laughs> rock is gonna be a song whereby when you listen to it, you have no choice than to just get up and dance and to just believe that the Lord is the rock that you stand on. This is a song you can play anywhere at a party, in your car. You, I mean, download it on iTunes, put it on your, put your earphone on, and just jam to it. And you can actually exercise with the song too. Mm. Actually, yes. So I'm not and gonna get the song. <laughs> <laughs> okay, sing, blow for me real quick. Ah, oh, Lord, it's a uh, off tempo, you know. You know, don't <laughs> okay, worry. you know what? What we're gonna do is we're I gonna don't clip it. You know, we're gonna clip it. We're gonna keep, keep you excited till yes. November twenty fourth. Yes, you yes. can check out this promo, this twenty one second promo on YouTube, and just you know, if you can't find it for any reason, put in A N U. And yes. you'll find her yes. right there on YouTube. Yes. And you just give the um, audience a message. Oh. There's a young lady out there watching you right now. And she was in a place that you were thinking, oh, I don't believe it myself. Mm -hmm. I can't do this. Yeah. Da -da 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 -da. And there's a lot of people who are talented. Yeah. Give them a message. Well, this is what I'm going to tell anybody that, um, that, that has a dream and a vision. Don't ever put yourself down. Always believe in yourself. Even when... People criticize what you're doing, but just don't worry about it. Put your hope on God. Put everything in the presence of the Lord. Believe in yourself. And the most important thing, always listen. It's so important. Always, always listen, but believe in yourself, That's which the is key the thing. most important thing. That's the key thing. Yeah. Thank you, girl. Thank you for coming mm -hmm. to the studio. It's you're really welcome. great to have you Thank here. You. And Thank I want to see you again when you get that album out. I want to see you when you're right there in the top yes. ten. And people yes. are like, Anu, 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 Anu. <laughs> I want to see you again. And I want to hear lots and lots and lots of great things yes. about you. Yes. I wish you the best Thank you of, so much. of success Thank you. in life. Thank you. Thank you so Ladies much. and gentlemen, mm -hmm. all the audience out there, my viewers, I really thank you for tuning into this edition of City Scene. That's that's my girl Anu doing great things. I want you to check her out on YouTube and you know go out there, download, support a sister, please. And before the show wraps up, I have a few announcements. And the announcement that I have, first and foremost, I have um, the expo. We've been talking about it the last few weeks. And this expo is coming up December 2nd, 2011. And Anu's gonna be singing yes. as well. Yes. yes. It's coming up um, December 2nd, 2 p.m. to 10 p.m. It's going to be at the Comfort Inn in Bowie, right here in Bowie, um, off Crane Highway. And this expo is basically to benefit local charities, which is a very key thing. We want you to come out, support. The most important thing about this is not only a fashion show and a concert where Anu will be singing, and there will be lots of vendors. You can actually participate in this expo. Vendorship opportunities available. We want you to come out, bring your items for sale, market your goods, market yes. yourself, promote yourself. I'm going to be an MC. I am an MC, a master of ceremony, so I'll be hosting that show. And you can come out, see us, meet us, greet us, and have fun. 60 to 70 percent off of all items. Christmas is coming up. Yeah. Why pay full price for a, an item in the store when you can come to the expo and shop, shop, shop? This event is being sponsored by Eric Air, um, Life Depicted phot uh, Photography, and the Comfort Inn, of course, and of course, FT Value in collaboration with Global Culture. Yeah. Don't forget to pick up a vendor slip. Come support us and also market your goods. Now, also talking about Eric Air, Eric Air is celebrating the second anniversary flying between Lagos to Nigeria and New York. So they're having an event and da -da 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 -da. it's going to be in New York at the Waldorf Astoria. I wish I could go. Hmm. I know, so if you're in New York, I want you to check them out. You know, it's going to be a great event. Eric Air, you can go to ericair.com and just look up 
more information on that. We also have um, the announcement for uh, um, Mountain of Fire and Ministries, and that's located in Bowie off of Church Road. And they're having an event on November 11th, 2011. And it's called No More Embargo. So check them out as well. Go to the website, Mountain of Fire um, website. Like I said, it's November 11th to um, November 13th. Great program. I want you to go out, pray, and break through before 2012. Last an announcement that I have is also the GPS program. Yay. GPS is the Global Prayer Summit and it's with Pastor Solomon of the Shadow of the Almighty Ministries in collaboration with the Redeemed Christian Church of God Restoration Center, which I go to. And we're right here in Greenbelt. It's gonna be at the Showplace Arena and it's December 9th to the 11th, 2011. I don't think I have any more announcements. Any more announcements? Mm, no. <laughs> if you have anything that you want to say to me as the host of City Scene, if you have suggestions, if you have comments, send us an email. You'll see it on the earned credits. Send us an email or go to Facebook.com and look for City Scene or Global Culture. This is City Scene. It's the happening scene. It's right here on Global Culture. Check us out on Facebook. Look out for me on Twitter. Yeah. Basically, keep in touch with me, and I'll keep in touch with you. I'm bringing to you all the happening scenes in the city of Bowie and surrounding areas. I think it's really, you know, worth it for you to get on my show. So if you're an artist just like Anu, <laughs> I'm going to keep referring to you. If you're an artist just like Anu, you're doing great things in your city, you're impacting your generation, impacting your city, I want you to come to City Scene and share with us what you're doing. Till next time, same time, same place, same face, I remain Shay Hopewell, and I hope to see you again. Take care. Be blessed. Bye bye. I do a little coda, be late, be a little boss in your car. We know Lumbumba. Got you, got you, got you, got you, got you. This one goes to all my fellow Africans <laughs> living far away. Far away. Far and away from their hometown. I do a little coda, be late, be a little boss in your car. We know Lumbumba. Got you. This one goes to all my fellow Africans <laughs> Living far away Far away Far and away from their hometown Ajo le don koda bile Bile la bossi mi yoko Awi no lumbumba Got you, got you, got you, got you, got you This one goes to all my fellow Africans <laughs> Living far away Far away Far and away from their hometown I do a little coda, be late, be late, la boss in your car. We know Lumbumba. Got you, got you, got you, got you, got you. This one goes to all my fellow Africans. <laughs> Living far away. Far away. Far and away from their home. I do a little coda, be late, be late, la boss in your car. We know Lumbumba. Got you, got you, got you, got you, got you. This one goes to all my fellow Africans <laughs> Living far away Far away Far